About four or five years ago, I started teaching both our MBA students and increasingly executives around climate change. And I was really struck that the way in which we standard as academics have taught about climate was not actually really relevant for most of the practitioners that we interacted with. So it really came out of this direct pedagogical interest. And then when you start thinking about what, the, what these companies are actually facing, it's really about how they interact with government, government policies and the way they have an effect on them. I came to the conclusion that we didn't really know a lot about that intersection. I'm Gunnar Trumbull. I'm a professor here at HBS. It's fascinating. If you talk to executives, what they will tell you is that normally when we have a problem, either we go to a consulting firm or we hire smart MBAs from HBS and we like bring them up through the system. It's fascinating. What they say, though, is this problem, we're setting net zero targets that we have to start meeting today. We don't have time to really kind of bring people up through the system. There, we're facing an executive class that needs to really almost entirely be like trained up in this area. There are a few places that are more important or have more leverage than HBS does to provide that kind of education and training. But it raises the question, what is it that these executives really need to know? And that's uh, an important part of the output that we hope from this project. This is the first event for GIST, so that is really exciting. Um, and you can see in this event, actually, our vision for the, the future of the project, which is that first it's about building community. So we have a pretty carefully selected group, some of the best academic scholars in this area, some of the really most thoughtful kind of forward-looking executives and practitioners in this area. And, um, and they're all here to get to know each other, and I hope to sustain supportive relationships over time. The other thing comes back to um, this question of what we should be teaching executives. And I, I've come to be quite concerned actually that the research agendas that we've traditionally had in academics around climate change are not really addressing the most important problems, the most salient problems. But I think this kind of exposure to the realities, the opportunities, but also the challenges of practitioners can over time help them to really see new and interesting problems that are that directly emerge out of the experience of business. And, and if, if we could make even just some of that happen, I think that would be a real, a real win for us. Mm -hmm.